away from improvements to help you do it. It's back, your all-time favorite expandable fence from Improvements, but it is a brand new design with these gorgeous florals that are in bloom all year round, no matter the weather, no matter how much you neglect them anywhere that you want, because it is faux florals on this incredible bamboo trellis style design. It's a lattice design. So look at these before and afters. I mean, maybe you've got an area of dead space on a fence or on the side of your house. Maybe you want to hide an AC unit or trash cans or I don't know, maybe you have wires or your gardening supplies you don't want to have to see. Maybe you just need some privacy. A lot of you love this on a chain link fence or maybe it's on your uh, balcony in your condo or in your apartment even. You've got it. Anywhere you want, you can expand this, you can hose it down. It's fade proof, it's weather proof. If you wanna add color as well, you can do it with this. We have four gorgeous choices. That is the ivory, there's the pink. We have it in this beautiful violet and we have the vibrant lush green. Oh, I love this idea too. For 24 hours only, it's a true 24 hour special. This is $39.95 for you. We have flex pay available, be $13 and change to get it home. It's gonna come with all the zip ties you can use. Look at this setup here, for instance. I mean, it looks gorgeous, right? Would you believe that we are actually beautifying and hiding a chain link fence? Looks okay right now. Looks absolutely gorgeous now. It's that simple, you guys. So let's talk all about it. You guys pick the color that you love. I will say, uh, last presentation, Deb Byers is here, by the way, um, with the expandable <laughs> fence. I was going to say, Deb, last presentation, pink was very, very popular okay. along with the green. So if you love those two, just keep that in mind because this price goes away at midnight once we have the full day. And also as the day wears on, the more popular colors could go. We have the violet and then we also have the ivory. I see you've got one here in your hands. I've got the beautiful pink one. And of course, it to me, it looks like cherry blossoms yeah. and it's absolutely gorgeous. And one thing that I want you guys to realize is when we say pink, we're saying pink, but just like mother nature, the back of these are gorgeous. Green. So there's a blend of the green, look at that, a blend of the green and the pink to give you that lush, thick, delicious look of blooms. But this is still the same expandable fence that you know and love. I'm just okay. going to swing it around Go and let everybody see the backside Ooh. is the same bamboo rods that you love to give you the expandability. And because of the blooms, they pop through. So if you're using this as a, a privacy fence between you and a neighbor, they're still going to see some of those beautiful blooms. Look at that, the change of wow. colors. It's just gorgeous. But the expandability Expandability is still here that you know and love to give you something that's going to expand to whatever size you need it mm. any time okay. when you get it out of so the box. So when it's just out of the box, yes. this is pretty pretty tall, actually. What is that, about three feet It's or four, so? feet. four feet. When it comes to you, it'll come in a long, narrow box. It'll be about a foot and a half wide and four feet tall. Okay. Easy breezy. And you get the 12 zip ties. But then... You can expand it. Look at this. And you can go as low oh, as you've got yeah. space. And now, wow, all that space that you've got under a deck or maybe under a porch or maybe just a place that you want to hide, now you've created a beautiful blooming fence to keep the critters out and to lend beauty. Because these fences will hide something unsightly, but they'll also mm. enhance it with these gorgeous blooms. It's just spectacular. It really really is gorgeous. Look at us up and down, up and down. <laughs> and see, and then I was saying, there you go, I sure. love this idea of vertical. I'm thinking on either side of my front door. Ooh. Love it. It looks like those beautiful houses you see in the, yes. in the expensive neighborhoods and they always have the beautiful vines and florals going up the house, right? 
and imagine what it, how long it would take if you were lucky enough to be able to have a green thumb that would allow you to grow some wisteria oh up the gosh. side of your house. The trimming, the fertilizing, the watering, having to wait when the winter time comes and it dies. This isn't going to do that. This is going to be for, ready for you all year long. I love that. Absolutely beautiful right out of the box. No matter the weather, no matter if you neglect it or you don't. I mean, honestly, even in the winter, how nice would it be to look outside and still see this beautiful life outdoors? Okay, it looks pretty realistic. The colors are incredible, and there's lots of um, unique and creative ways that we can use these, right? Well, why don't we take that one? To, okay. We've got, because on the set, we were walking around, and we thought, you know, there are a couple of places that could look a little, you know, that we could yeah. add a little beauty to. So if you wouldn't mind bringing that, sure. it's lightweight enough for you to carry, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Okay, so we've got this beautiful fireplace. Now, if you can see here along the bottom, we've got it expanded about, it'll be about nine feet. So it's covering the bottom here. That looks great. But like you that. could put this behind the, your garden and let your flowers be in front of it. It'll help to brighten up a barren space. But we've got a plain space here mm -hmm. that really could use some help. So why don't we just make this okay. beautiful here we instantly? Go. Here we go. Look at that. Wow. No green thumb necessary. It looks like living. Art. Isn't that gorgeous? Because people do this too. They do this with plants. They do this where you have to get, put the trellis behind it and then hope that it grows in one or two seasons. You have to keep it alive. You have to water it. It has to have the right amount of sunlight. With this, <laughs> You don't do anything. You yeah. just hang it up and you're good to go. You're 100% right. If it gets a little dusty, maybe spray it a little bit. Sure. But that's about the extent of whatever you're going to have the to do. the difference that made. And remember, any place you put it, it doesn't have to be permanent because this is something that can go inside your home outside your home. We had someone say, oh, I used it as a headboard in my bedroom. Well, That's imagine creative. a violet headboard or this gorgeous pink or yes. the green. And the green, I love the green because it looks like an English hedgerow. It's uh -huh. got so many different shades. But you're going to be able to use this vertically yeah. or horizontally, and it's ready to go right out of the box. This idea I thought was so smart. This is using two of the Today Specials to create this angle and this may be the side of your house. It could be from the front. You can always see along the side, right? And maybe you're trying to hide. <laughs> I love that. Right? Things like your garbage cans or your recycle bins or an AC unit. Those are pretty unsightly. Or your pool equipment, even, if you just want to have a way. And by the way, you can still easily access the areas, too. Let's The one I have under the stairs by my pool, I just use little twisty ties. So when I need to get back there to get the things stored underneath, I can untwist open it up, get the things I want, and then close it back up again. So it doesn't have to be permanent. Well, this and the, the, you, the um, these are two that are tied together with the zip ties. You're getting 12 zip ties. Yeah. So we just made a right angle with the zip ties in the center and made it freestanding. And a lot of uh, homeowners associations don't want you to have something unsightly. This right. is the perfect way for you to add that beauty with no maintenance. Yes. Because remember, it's going to come to you with the the expandability built in on those bamboo rods on the back. There's no ugly side to this because the back side is just as beautiful as the front. So if you're using this as a privacy between you and a neighbor, remember what you're looking at is the back. And look at how the blooms just kind of drape across those beautiful bamboo rods. It makes it so spectacular whether you're coming or going and it looks really natural, just like Mother Nature intended. So you've got the ability to go ahead and hide that thing that's unsightly or just make something beautiful Boom, with the gorgeous blooms on the front. I keep I thinking about this. how people do these walls and then they hang like a neon sign yes. or it says it's somebody's birthday or it's a baby shower or a wedding even. People use this kind of thing as like a backdrop for photo opportunities too. This example I thought was so impactful because right Right now, it looks gorgeous, right? And by the way, we've got these spheres available too, which we'll share with you in just a moment. But do you know what this is actually hiding? Let me go ahead and walk across here. Look what was behind it. Chain link fence. And you know how expensive it is to get a new fence. Not only that, you have to schedule someone, you have to wait, you have to hope they actually show up after you've already <laughs> paid them. That happens to a lot of us, right? Well, here is your instant quick fix. Look at this. 
that you can expand and change the height, the width, you can go low and long, you can go tall and lean. I mean, it's totally up to you with this, but I just think that is so impactful compared to what it would be if you didn't have this. I mean, look at that difference. It's huge. Wow. And if, oh, oh, I, they fell over. <laughs> and if you've got, got dogs, it. I mean, my dog goes crazy every time the delivery truck comes to bring my uh, my things from HSN. Yeah. He goes absolutely nuts. Because they can see them. They can see them. But now we have the opportunity to hide them and have that beauty at the same time. So this is going to be something that you're going to be able mm -hmm. to enjoy wherever you put it. And remember, whether you want to hide something or you simply want to beautify something. Now, you were talking about fences. So we've got a fence here that's actually very nice. So imagine yes. we're living in a condo and they're pretty good about what they do as far as putting a protection up. But maybe there's a parking lot on the other mm. side there. So we, yeah. you know, we spent a lot of money on our condo and we want to be able to sit on our balcony and have yes. a pleasant conversation. Look at how gorgeous this is. It took a relatively attractive regular railing and made it that much wow. better. So now we can sit here like we're in an outdoor space and we're really in a condo on the 12th floor yeah. overlooking the parking lot, but you would never <laughs> know that because we've got this gorgeous fence. Right. And this happens to be the ivory and you can see how the, the beautiful green and ivory work together. It's so beautiful. Or maybe it's on a balcony where right next to you there's nothing. So you're outside and your neighbor's outside and it can be kind of awkward, right? Mm -hmm. And you want a little privacy that way, you could put it that way to the side as well. Think about all these different uses you could have inside as well. Maybe you've got a sunroom and there's oh. a really cool spot and you want it to look like you did one of those living walls that people do, but with no maintenance, with no bugs, with no watering restrictions, no light you have to worry about, even the time of year, the temperature, none of it matters when you have this. And I love that this is a brand new design on an already tried and true favorite. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, you know, it's funny, you're talking about no bugs, but I have to tell you that when I put it on my fence in my yard and you saw the pictures of the before and afters. I had them on my fence and I brought them inside. There you go, you see it. So my fence is six by eight. It's a regular wooden fence. And it's, it's you know, it's pretty straight ahead, it's plain. But when we put the purple across the top and had the plants on the bottom, I love that. it just lends itself to absolute beauty. And then, of course, my partial, I'm partial to the pink one. I love that. But then again, you see the plants at the bottom and it looks like I've got wisteria hanging from the top. It makes me look like an, ex an expert gardener, but that's not the case. It's just the fence. And then if I really wanted to fill the entire space, I've got two of them. So you've got the top and the bottom. That's a six by eight foot space with two, one on top of the other to give you that entire look of the gorgeous blooms on the one Gosh. panel of my fence. Well, I'd love to show you the color options up close so you can really get an appreciation for it because I think when you get it home you will be so impressed and so excited honestly to add some color and some life to the areas around your home. This is the violet and it is a really intense vibrant violet. Isn't that a beautiful purple? It really is and really and seriously guys when we're done with the presentation google wisteria and look at the color that mother nature makes for those gorgeous flowers mm -hmm. and you'll see that the the improvements team hit it right out of the park with that beautiful violet. That it's violet. absolutely true to Mother Nature's color. Here's the pink next to the violet. And when you see that up close, you'll see the green coming through as well. It's as Love it. how it would be out in Mother Nature. Look at that. So it is a beautiful, and you're right, it reminds me of cherry blossoms. Mm -hmm. It's that perfect pink and these are these delicate little blooms that you know when you see it either up close or from afar they're just stunning next to that is the green and the green is like what you would see what were we saying before it was like a english like an you know, english boxwood yes, hedge, like a hedge like row. a hedge row that's what it looks like and it really does look like that and again so many beautiful shades of green in there but you know the english have those hedges that are so yes. pristine and so precisely trimmed they're grown, they've got expert gardeners, they're doing a whole lot of maintenance on yeah. it. You're gonna have that look ready to go as no soon as the box what. arrives. And Absolutely. then you have the ivory all the way at the end. And Which, that one is beautiful it's too. It's another favorite. Oh, so 
I, you can't yeah. go wrong. They're absolutely gorgeous. But however you decide to use them, whether you use them vertically inside your home or vertically outside your home or horizontally, wherever you put them, you're going to be able to have that same expandability mm -hmm. that you know and love from the improvements team on the expandable fence. Look at this. But you've got blooms now. Look at this. We're gonna go all, all the, way. the way down. I mean, we're almost nine feet away from each other at and, this point. And would you say this is like maybe about 16 inches high? Yeah, possibly? yeah, that seems about right. And maybe you've got that like a crawl space under the home you wanna hide or an area along your fence even. That was a good idea. I think yes, because in my yard, I've got flowers, but they haven't bloomed yet. So I have to wait for my flowers to bloom. Yeah. But across the back, I've got the plain nothing. So when I put this back there, it's started to sort of jumpstart my feeling about spring and summer, <laughs> knowing that it's coming. And then once the flowers bloom, I've got the pink, and I know it's just going to be spectacular, yes. absolutely spectacular. And I'm just going to leave it there and let it fill Look. up that empty space. And as we come closer, it will go taller. Maybe you want to do this vertically if you've got an area here. Watch this. So, I mean, we could go from this all the way up to... Look at this. I mean, this is... Taller than me, look how high we can go with this. And it will get narrower, obviously, as you go up, or you maybe you wanna bring it down just a little. If you've got spots on the side of your house or up a stairway, maybe, even, it would look like these were growing up a trellis. Absolutely, or, or if you've got a pergola, if you're lucky enough to oh. have a pergola, so many people have pergolas in their backyard. Do it on the top. You can do it on the top. And if you did it on the top, you yes. could fix it with the zip ties, but the blooms would hang down. So it oh would be gosh. almost this like, way. It would, it, like Exactly, this. oh my gosh, look what hang happens. On, let me get underneath. Here okay. we go. Like this. So look what happens, <gasps> the flowers hang down. <laughs> oh, that, that just gave me so I many know. ideas. Oh, yes. I love that. My parents have a pergola in their backyard and they've got the fire pit underneath it and it's beautiful, but this would add that magical touch. Can you to imagine? It. Just wow. fabulous. So I think wherever you put it, you're going to have absolute beauty. Yeah. And again, remember, the back is just as beautiful as the front because it's not just, oh, the back is how things are made and put together, right. so you just have to deal with it. Yeah. No, the real bamboo rods give you that gorgeous lattice look, and then it, hap oh, and then it happens that the flowers pop through. So you're going to have beauty on the back, just like you have on the front. So there's no there's no downside to this fabulous fence. Yeah, this is the back, just so we can show what you're talking about. And that's actual bamboo. Yep. And it's a very durable material. It's, again, it adds to the beauty. Like you want to see that peeking through, you know? I think it's absolutely gorgeous. And then you had this fabulous idea back here of how maybe you're not hiding anything at all. Maybe you just want to enhance your area. This fireplace is beautiful, but you know, it's kind of plain up top there. So we want to change that, right? I think we can do it instantly. I think we can Look too. at how gorgeous that is. Ta-da! That is so beautiful. Maybe you have some little hooks that you, you know, put here or some nails. We have the brick hooks available as well and you just hang it right on there. It's not heavy. We both got one arm holding this up. Oh, if this were a real fireplace and you did have brick, that's a great idea right? because you could put the zip ties on. Oh my gosh, your brain is just See? working. <laughs> <laughs> so it. many options, <laughs> you guys. You can have so much fun with this. We've got one down low down here that we expanded if you're trying to hide an area down at the bottom. So inside, outside, anywhere you want. Light doesn't matter. Right? It doesn't matter. Rain or how much, you know, watering it's getting, doesn't matter because it's faux. You don't have to worry. I love that you can hose this down mm -hmm. if you need to clean it off. Maybe you've got them like we have in the corner over here. This is the ivory, and we took two of the Today's Specials, and we catty-cornered them so that we could create this right angle so that you could easily walk behind here and grab your garbage cans <laughs> to take them out on garbage day. But when I set it down, it completely disappears. I was joking, I'm like, Deb, you should jump out of this when we do the launch because <laughs> you can't see anything behind it. It just looks like beautiful greenery. So maybe this is your big AC unit or your pool equipment. Maybe you've got, I don't know, your gardening supplies back here. If you wanna hide the floats for the pool, I mean, anything, you don't visually want to see that clutter, this is the perfect way to hide it. And then I think this example is so, 
striking. When you look at this beautiful violet and you think this just is gorgeous, right? Then you realize it's actually hiding a chain link fence. I mean, that it doesn't get simpler than that. Look at how drastic that difference is. It's amazing, and it's super easy to attach. You're going to get the 12 zip ties that'll allow it to affix to something like a chain link fence, but they're also lightweight, so you can hang yes. them on regular hooks. You can just put a nail in or a screw in and just hang them off of that. But again, this is going to be vertical or horizontal. However low you want to go, however high you want to go, you're going to be having those gorgeous blooms which is the the beginning of there having now that beauty no replacing your fence you just saved yourself a couple grand oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> it is not cheap to replace a fence and then not only that you have to hire somebody wait to be booked for the time they can actually come hope they actually show up after you've just paid hopefully not the whole thing they always say just do a deposit yeah, first because right. you never know if they're going to actually show up and do it. Let's forget all that hassle and then let's add some color along the way because we have four beautiful color options that you can choose from. The ivory and the green are the most uh, foliage based, right? If you want full bloom like florals, you might want to go with the pink or with the violet. You're, they're all gorgeous, so you really cannot go wrong. I love this idea on a dock even. Maybe there's just a space where you want a little more privacy, add this and now you've got it instantly. Well, the other thing too is how, mu how much time would it take and how much effort would it take in order for you to have something that's going to be beautiful? If you just wanted a regular hedge, think about the time involved in just growing a hedge. Well, this is going to be ready for you out of the box, this gorgeous cherry blossom look. Look at how spectacular that is. I can't get over how gorgeous these beautiful yes. flowers are, and they're going to be coming to you, and this is going to be able to be your story, whether it's vertical or horizontal. And again, you're in charge of how you want to hang it. It's absolutely stunning as a trellis. It's absolutely stunning to hide a fence. It hides a garbage can. Think about it. You've got a beautiful fence that's spectacular in color, covered in blooms, hiding your trash can. Yes. I mean, that <laughs> is just the height of wonderfulness. All year long, these will look absolutely gorgeous as well. $39.95. I mean, what a quick instant, you know, easily attainable upgrade to your home. And when you think about curb appeal, plants make such a huge difference. They really make your landscape seem um, pretty magical. I think mm -hmm. it adds this element. I mean, I feel like we're in a secret garden at this point. It's just so beautiful. This is like what you see when you're on vacation or you're at those beautiful cafes or you, you drive through the nice neighborhoods yeah. where it's, everything is so well manicured because people take care of it, right? But it's, it's a lot of time and money and commitment. And it can be really frustrating if you can't keep those beautiful florals alive that you spend a ton of money on, right? With some Something like this, it's a one and done. You never have to worry about it. You can move them if you decide you want to move them somewhere else. If you rent, this is a mm -hmm. huge upgrade that you can take with you. You don't dig anything up. You don't have to leave it there when you leave. If you've got a balcony and you live in a condo and you want to add that extra privacy, now you've done it. A lot of people use these inside. I loved your idea. You heard about someone used it as a headboard. headboard. Can you imagine how beautiful wow, that would be? a wall, a even. Absolutely, and you know, the trend is in all the malls or the high-end restaurants or the casual restaurants are these walls of blooms or greenery. Right. And then you mentioned the neon signs so that people can have pictures taken in front of them. Pinterest, Pinterest, Pinterest. Yeah. Well, now you're going to have that look and you're going to be able to put it virtually anywhere. And again, the blooms are so gorgeous. This beautiful pink, I can't tell you, is just spectacular because it's not just pink, there's green in there too. Right. So we really wanted to make them look as natural as possible. And again, don't forget that expandability that you know and love that's been so famous with our expandable fences is still there on the back, but it's new and improved because the blooms come through. So the backside is just as beautiful as the front. Absolutely, just choose which color that you love. This is a true 24 hours only today's special. 
available. Uh, it looks like right now at this point, green would be the first to go uh, really? as we get throughout the day. Yeah, this one, the green and the pink are most popular right now, but green, the trajectory that it's on, it's now at this point the most limited option. So that's worth keeping in mind. If you're waiting until later in the day to pick it up, we can't always guarantee your favorite color is going to be available necessarily. Um, also, if you wanted to even, you know, Oh. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, alternate? Alternate. I'm like, coordinate in my oh, head. Look, 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 oh, look, 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 look. There you go. Look oh, how cool that man. would be. That would That's be actually, stunning. That would be incredible wow. to do something like that. I you, love it. Be creative. Have fun with this. You know, you have 30 days to try it out, by the way. If you get it home, hang it up somewhere, kind of play with it, put it in different spots. 30 days to try it. If you don't love it, you can send that back. We have free exchanges. If for some reason you decide you want a different color, you could do that as well. Just keep in mind, you can go high, you can go wide, or should we show them one more time? Oh, yes. How yes. you can go low as well. Um, this is quite the opportunity to add florals that never die to your home. Look at how cool, look how low this can get if you need to as well. Use the FlexPay. Um, keep in mind if you apply for the HSN credit card right now, when you're approved, we give you $40 to put toward any single item purchase. This is $39.95. So you would just be paying sales tax and your shipping and you're good to go on that. That's awesome. That's pretty good, right? So excited to add this brand new design to the all time favorite expandable improvements um, fence here. So you can call us, you can head to hsn.com, you can use our free app to get your orders in as well. It's all available for you right on our homepage too, right? When you go to hsn.com, you'll see the today's special. So take advantage of that. A lot of you loving the spears that we have available too. They were very popular last hour because we have all the same colorways. And Deb, this is something we're seeing in home design and lawn design everywhere right now is this look of these spheres, but they're not easy to maintain when they're live. Absolutely, when they're live, boy oh boy, you've gotta have mad scissor skills, you've mm -hmm. gotta make sure, you've gotta wait for them to grow, but not for you guys, because we have these from Improvements, the spheres, they're 13 inches in diameter. They weigh about two pounds each, so you can hang them. They're absolutely stunning. They're ready to go right out of the box. And what we did is just put them in regular little pots here and you just place them in there and then you've got instant beauty or Look you can that. hang them. I love, love, <laughs> love them. Aren't they fabulous? I can't wait. I want to get a couple of these to put by the front door, yes, but also my back patio. We've got really cool outdoor furniture and we need the plants, but we don't get good sunlight. These would be great because they're faux. So we have all the same colors. That's the green. We have the violet. You have the ivory. Yep and that beautiful pink. And I love that you get two of these. At this price, that's about $25 each. They're very lush, too. They're you can't see through lush. them or anything. Absolutely gorgeous. By the way, these planters are available as well. We have a set of four. So you can get four in that blue, or you can do four in the red. Um, so if you are interested in those, take a look at the details on hsn.com. It's 774-488 is the item number. And then, Deb, before we let you go, we gotta talk about these wreaths as well. They were very, very popular. Come on over here with me, you guys. Oh my gosh. I'm going to pop these. them up while you're so, talking. So, okay. These are 21 inches. We have all the same colorways. We've got the violet, the pink, the green, and the ivory for you. You saw in that video how beautiful that looks with the spheres on either side of the door, too. But $29.95 for these. This is, this is crazy. The same beautiful blooms. They're 21 inches. They weigh less than two pounds, so they're easy, easy to hang. But they are so gorgeous, aren't they? And you're seeing a beautiful shot of each one of the colors and they lend themselves to being decorated. So if you wanted to have these dur during the holidays, you could put bows on them, you could put lights on them, you oh, could yeah. do all kinds of things, but they're going to be a beautiful way for you to decorate your front door, get the entire suite, get the vents, get the spheres, get the wreath, mm. and you'll have it all going on. And of course, they're weather resistant, they're fade resistant as well. So definitely scoop those up. I'm loving the violet. I just I think, oh, it's so pretty. It's so, we so get pretty. a favorite every time we think. No, oh, no, I, so now hard. I love this one. I'm loving I the ivory. I think you won't be disappointed no matter which one you choose. And please don't forget about our offer that we're doing with the HSN credit card. This is the most we offer. Um, when you apply and you're approved, we give you $40. You can put that toward any single item purchase you would like. The today's special is $39.95. So, I mean, but what a great 
uh, incentive <laughs> to get the HSN card. By the way, with that card, you get VIP savings events. You get exclusive access to that. We have extra flex pay on certain items with that as well. Um, so just look into it. There's no annual fee either. So I really think you might enjoy the HSN card if you were interested. All right. These I thought were so beautiful. I missed out on these last season. They're a huge customer pick. This is the first airing of the spring season. These are from Larkin Meadow. They are solar wind chimes and they look like stained glass in person, Deb. Aren't they beautiful? Uh, and we've got four different critters. Yes, we okay. have two insects and we have two birds. So I think you're looking at uh, the well, hummingbird. Yes, the hummingbird. They have an LED light. So the lights are in different places on the different insects or the different birds, but they're spectacular. They're about two and a half feet long. They have a charge, charging panel in the top. So all you're gonna do is turn them on, let the sun get absorbed in the solar panel. And then at night, the LED lights will come on. You've got little twinkly bells. Uh -huh. You have simply hang them on a hook and enjoy them yes. because they're going to be such a beautiful addition to your home. They're very, very spectacular. Well, let's talk about the design. So right now you're seeing the bee up close, and that one is really beautiful. Next to that is the butterfly. So we'll show you that. We have to take close-ups because when we're, there you go. Look how pretty. Look nice how gorgeous shot. that is. Look at that. So that's the butterfly. Here we have the cardinal, which is that vibrant red, always very popular every season for sure. A lot of people love cardinals. They, they have a very spiritual meaning to them as well so you might want to scoop that up while you can and hummingbird is last call really already, already first airing of the season hummingbird we've got two dozen wow if you want to get those and then as you look down you'll notice i mean these look like true custom works of art that you would find at an art show they absolutely do the hummingbird has almost a stained glass look you've got the little twinkly bells at the bottom there are amber beautiful amber balls in there look at how gorgeous that is and the bee and the bumblebee has lights inside so he's going to light up from the inside and the then there's a, he's got a, a little cutout design. The same thing with the Cardinal. His body will absolutely light up. Look how beautiful Ooh. that is. Absolutely gorgeous. And then we, that's, there's your hummingbird. And the, the, oh, I think it's getting dark in here. Oh, that's it. <laughs> I think it is. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Almost. So uh, keep in mind too, these are rust resistant, fade resistant. They're weather resistant. We are kind of playing with the lights while you guys are seeing the video. It's hard in a studio. We're not on our outdoor set, but we look, we wanted to show you, look at this. So when we drop the lights down, you can see where those are placed. They're different for every one that you pick up. So this is that beautiful hummingbird. Not sure how many we have left at this point. 20. Okay. Oh my goodness. 20. This is the first airing of the season. Uh, the butterfly that you have your hand on, Deb, we only have a hundred of those left. Well, the, one of the things I want to tell you about the beautiful butterfly is you're absolutely right. It looks like stained glass. There are seven little amber jewels all around this butterfly. So he's really rocking it. Then you've got the amber beads. They all three of them, all four of them have three amber beads, little flowers, and then the the tinkling bells, so you've got the beautiful lights at night, so when the lights come on, the LED light is all around the circumference of the insect, here we go, and then you've got the beautiful tinkling bells, and all you need to do is hang it so that the sun can expose, be exposed to the solar panel and enjoy it. They're two and a half feet long and eight inches in diameter, all, th all four of them, but each one is just more charming than the next. I love the, the bumblebee because his body lights up and in the back, there's a beautiful little cutout design. And it's the same with the Cardinal. So he's got a little bit of a design when the lights come through, it absolutely just enhances Aww. it. But you can't go wrong. Yeah. They're all so beautiful and whimsical. I loved reading the reviews on this. These are a customer pick. A lot of people said they put it outside of a window so that they can enjoy it, enjoy it whether they're inside or outside. Mm -hmm. And the size on this is incredible. It's about 30 30 inches in length and then you've got this guy is about nine inches the circular part across so very substantial you can see it and then I love Deb how the solar 
little solar panel is right on the top here. So when yeah. it's dark, that'll be covered up. That's when it lights up at night. So it just takes in the sun throughout the day. Beautiful. And then again, they're just as beautiful during the day as they are yeah. at night. And in a soft breeze, you're going to hear that little twinkling bell, which is so charming. And they're just lovely. You've got the four choices to choose from. So whether you want two insects, you've got the beautiful bumblebee, you've got the beautiful butterfly, or the, you have the choice of the two birds with the gorgeous cardinal or that beautiful hummingbird. Well, maybe yeah. not anymore, the hummingbird. That, right? that one will go. When we get through, oh, it's okay. Congrats. <laughs> it's sold out. <laughs> Congratulations if you got that one. The cardinal is so handsome. I love the red. Just is so vibrant. The butterfly, again, we've got about 100 of those. And then we have the bumblebee as well. Think about this as a gift idea, too. Every time they look at it, they'll think of you for buying it for them. Deb, thank you so much. My pleasure. Such a blast. Good. We're going to see you throughout the day. Yes, okay. yes, we yes. We've got that today's special. Don't forget about that in bloom expandable fence from Improvement. So thank you so much. When we return, we're going to talk about florals. We've got some lavender and some roses from Leaf and Petal. Don't go anywhere. Tune in to Celebrity Hot List, a day of star-studded programming dedicated to your most loved celebrity brands, including Jessica Simpson, Christian Siriano, Joanna Garcia Swisher, Juliana Rancic, and the premiere of TPA Chair Care by Taraji P. Henson. It's a full day of incredible offers, hot new styles for you and your home, insider tips, plus special programs. Celebrity Hot List starts Thursday at midnight, only on HSN. Trusted by millions, she is one of America's most successful female inventors. If somebody's struggling, I look at how could I make that better for them? For 25 years, Joy Mangano has been part of the HSN family. The HSN customer is who I dream about. And she's just getting started. The product we're creating is amazing. Don't miss Joy Mangano here on HSN. Retire? I have too much fun. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. My name is Luis Vargas and I'm a lighting designer here at HSN. As a lighting designer here at HSN, I design the lighting look. Well, the customer is the person that we like for. I'm always trying to light for what I think she would like or what would catch her attention. You can shop anywhere, but you chose us and I don't take that lightly. Thank you for inviting us into your home. Welcome back into HSN. So good to be shopping with you. My name is Michelle Yarn, and we're talking all things lawn and garden. It is time. We are so excited and ready for the fresh air and being outdoors and enjoying that. We've got leaf and petal coming up in just a moment. I wanted to share with you a couple of outfit details. We've started sharing what we, the hosts, are wearing because it's one of the biggest questions that we get. So we are now featuring our outfits of the day. And starting with this top, it's Colleen Lopez. It's a beautiful eyelet design. It's actually long sleeve has elastic so I just pulled it up a little bit but beautiful colors love the v-neck here as well I just think it's gorgeous $44.99 for that one the pants that I'm wearing these are G by Juliana and they are called the sugar wash linen blend and this is the papyrus it's a really pretty light cream they come in black and navy as well and then my shoes are Vince Camuto they're these actually very comfortable little gladiator style sandals and they have this kind of double buckle which is really Really cool and they're leather by the way and this is the vanilla color but there are lots of options so if you ever want to know what we're wearing I know that was quick but there is a feature page called host closet now on hsn.com so you can search host closet scroll down and see what all of us have worn throughout the last couple of days and if you ever have any other questions hit me up on Instagram or Facebook I'm Michelle yarn HSN I get a lot of um, questions and messages and I reply to every single one of you as quickly as 
I can. So I love to talk to you there. Okay, so as we are celebrating springtime and bringing new life to our lawn and our gardens, we wanna spend some time with leaf and petal designs. They help everyday people like you and I make our yards look magnificent. And there are a couple of incredible sales I wanted to share with you. This one is on Sensational Lavender. How beautiful are these? So what you are getting is actually three of these sensational lavender in these little pots. You'll get a brochure that tells you exactly how and where to plant these and take care of them, but it couldn't be simpler, honestly. These are super bright, beautiful lavender once they bloom. It's $24.95 for all three of them. And I am gonna welcome in Rochelle Grayer. She is a landscape designer, a gardening expert. She is an author as well. Rochelle it's so good to see you. You know all the ins and outs of all of these plants. So welcome in, my friend. Thank you. Oh, you're, you're welcome. I'm glad to be here. And um, especially with this lavender, yes. I'm excited. It's, I'm up here in Boston. We're finally getting outside and we can plant. And this is one of the plants that I've always been excited for because you used to not be able to grow lavender very well um, pretty much anywhere in the U.S. But with recent um, years, kind of in the last three, four years, we have had a lot of breeding with lavender. And mm -hmm. this is one of the products of that. This is called the Sensational Lavender. That's a little play on words, Sensational. And that's because this lavender has been bred specifically for two very important things. One, the scent. Um, and that is by having these um, flower buds that have more of the lavender oil than any other uh, variety of lavender. Oh. So if you're growing it for the scent, and who isn't? You're going to love this one because this yeah. one has um, a lot of that oil. And that, that means if you're crafting or you're wanting to harvest it, or I like to bring these into my house and uh, make little satchels or hang it in my mm -hmm. shower or, or above my kitchen sink when I'm doing dishes, you're just going to have even more of that scent. But also those yeah. flowers are just going to be so fragrant right outside your door as well. But here's the other thing. Lavender has always been difficult for American gardeners to grow because we've always had English lavenders and French lavenders that really were bred to do well in those locations, but we didn't have ones that were bred to do well in American gardens and in our climate. This is definitely one of those newer lavenders that is going to be hardy all the way up here in Boston, all the way down south as well, and it is going to grow actually very well. So you can get that beautiful Provençal look where you've got, you yes. know, just hedges <laughs> and mounds of silvery foliage with, uh, you know, those beautiful purple spikes. Um, they make a great, great hedge and uh, are really, you know, fantastic detail to add to your garden. Um, and these these are going to come to you uh, pretty soon. I mean, uh, if you take a look at our shipping map, map uh, most people, they're going to ship right away yes. um, up north. Uh, you're going to get them um, kind of in a couple weeks. We ship them when they're uh, ready to be planted. So, um, you know, some of you are ready to plant them now. We're going to ship them out right away. I'm up north. We've still got another week or so. Mm -hmm. not but quite I love even. that so because pretty much shipping everywhere. Leaf and Petal really yeah, plans ahead. it out for you so that when it arrives, it's ready to be planted. So you don't have to do any guesswork. Yep. You don't have to think about it. Everyone's going to get a brochure like this that has photos. It describes exactly what to do where to put it, how to care for it. And I will recommend leafandpetaldesigns.com as well because you can get so much info about everything that you're picking up. So these are absolutely sensational lavender and they're gonna be brighter. They've got a great tolerance for heat and humidity and they really will thrive for you. So I think that is so exciting to be able to get these home. You're gonna get three of them. They're gonna look just like this and you'll have all the info that you need to get started with that for sure. And we have more to share with you, um, but I wanted to share something we're starting now on Mondays. It's called Mystery Sale Mondays. And so what that means is every Monday, there will be brand new sales on items that you don't know until you click. It's always a mystery. It could always be something different. This Monday in particular, it's jewelry that you're going to find on sale with incredible deals and flex pay up to 30% off on the jewelry. So every Monday, it will be a new mystery sale Monday, but it's only good for that day. So that's really exciting. Okay, we're gonna move from lavender now and talk about, these are always so popular. These are the miniature 
roses. It's a miniature rose collection. They're super hardy. They look delicate and beautiful, but these can actually thrive in all different types of locations. And if you're looking at your screen and you're saying, how am I gonna choose which color I want? You don't have to. You're getting all four of these. For $19.95, you're gonna get the Amber Sun Blaze, the Pink Crush, the Red Sun Blaze, and the Rise and Shine. They are magnificent. I love that we get all four colors, Rochelle. This is how they're gonna come to yeah. us. By the way, all of our live plants are free shipping and handling as well. So tell me about these miniature roses and who can enjoy these. Basically anybody. These are amongst the very, very toughest, yeah. toughest uh, roses. So, you know, they can take a lick and then keep on ticking, basically. Um, what you're going to get is this. Um, these roses are actually kind of like planting annuals. We plant annuals because they give us such a flourish of blooms. Um, and, and we like that the, with the, all the color and, and, um, and all the brightness for the season. And here we're getting that in roses, first of all. They are actual roses. Mm. but they're going to bloom like an annual they're going to bloom so much and for so long that's what's really great about them the other thing i really love about these while they're not particularly fragrant they are um uh, multi-stemmed so uh basically you know when you think about roses uh a different kind of rose we're gonna have another one coming up here in just a minute they're they tend to be um fewer blooms per stem maybe only one long stem roses for example one bloom per stem these have a whole spray of roses on a stem so they're smaller but you get lots of them so yeah, if you love this. to have uh, flowers in your garden that you can cut and bring in as a bouquet these ones are really easy to arrange and you of course you get all four colors which is amazing yes. um, and these are th just really nice in your garden they're kind of a nice mid-level sort of plant you know they almost act like a ground cover but they're not that low they're a little bit taller they're about a foot tall and they're just stunning i mean look at all those colors they're so the beautiful roses vibrant. all summer look at the orange they i mean that really truly are. looks like a sunset the pink is like this bright fuchsia pink color it's just stunning um and these two rochelle when so when i get these home they come to me and we're yeah. going to get all four of them they're in this little planter it's mainly stem yep. um what do i do with it when i get it home you're going to want to plant these in a nice full sun spot. Okay. Um, they are going to bloom for you this year for sure. They will continue because they're perennials to come back year in and uh, again and again. So you, every year they'll get a little bit bigger. What you're looking at there on the set is probably year two or three. Okay. Um, but they're going to bloom for you all summer. You're going to get blooms on blooms on blooms. That's what's really amazing about the mini roses is that they bloom so much more than the bigger roses. Right. They're really all about um, just a, just an abundance. Look at all these flowers. An abundance of flowers. And these are like the uh, like the lavender. They are going to ship um, pretty much right away across the country, except for in the most north. You might have to wait just a, little, a week or so. Um, but for the most part, everybody is shipping at this point. And I wanted to say. Lavender and roses are the most classic and perfect and just stunning and popular and you can't go wrong a combination of plants to grow together. They like to grow together. They look beautiful together. So if you're kind of trying to think like, well, lavender, roses, we have another rose coming up. These are excellent combination. They both love that full sun. They both smell amazing. They both attract the same pollinators and they like to go to both plants. And then of course, if you harvest them they make a beautiful bouquet together as well so i mean you absolutely can't go wrong oh and just to note the lavender foliage is such a nice frame for this uh rose foliage i don't know if you can see oh. that all that well but they're really pretty together and they're really nice contrast so and imagine this with the purple flowers and this with all the you know pinks and yellows and and uh, reds yeah. and you really you know it's just a nice frame so you know really think about um we do this on purpose by the way this isn't like a total accident we try to put right. plants together to help you help you know what goes well together so right. you know we got a couple more things coming they all really do work well together so um roses though you i mean honestly 
you can't go wrong. And these make a great gift, by the way, too, if you're thinking like a Mother's Day gift. Absolutely. I've given my mom roses for years. Well, years. think about she what you would them. spend just for a bouquet that's going to die in yeah. a week or so. Or you could spend under a $20 bill, you get all four of these colors four. and they get to enjoy it for years and years to come. And I loved your ideas, Rochelle, yeah. about doing the lavender with it. Not only would that look visually beautiful, can you imagine the scent? That incredible lavender, mm. the beautiful rose. It's just equal parts tranquil yeah. and invigorating and just, oh, I think it would yeah. just be magnificent. This is why we love this time of year so much. So if you love these, you do get all four. This is how they will come to you. You can put them in containers. Yeah. You can plant them in the ground. They love full sun as well. Yeah, these... And I just, I love that you get to enjoy these blooms nearly year round. I mean, they are just constant, beautiful blooms for you. So if you want to pick these up, you can go to hsn.com and type in the item number. You could even search the keyword plants and all of our plants and florals will pop up. And actually right now for, I believe it's for the whole month of April, we're doing free shipping on all of our live plants. So that is a great way to go ahead and scoop up lots of different colors and different types and you'll get free shipping on all of it just through the end of April. Also keep in mind, if you don't have the HSN credit card, you might want to pick it up. You get extra flex pays on this stuff with your HSN credit card and when you're approved, we'll give you $40 to put toward any single item purchase you would like. So that's a really nice way to get some extra savings. And by the way, the extra perks that you get with the HSN credit card, like extra flex pay on items like fashion and beauty and jewelry, even these beautiful plants we've been sharing with you. We do really fun VIP savings events as well. So that's something to look forward to with the HSN card. And you can even use it when you're shopping at QVC, our sister station as well. Okay, so we've talked about incredible uh, roses. We've talked about the lavender. Now we're gonna move on and talk about the Homestead Pink Verbena. And what I love about these is they can really fill a space. So yes, they're gorgeous in containers, but when you talk about ground cover as well, these are beautiful to use. You could do these on edging, maybe your mixed containers that you're doing. These are what they would call the spiller <laughs> and the filler, actually. They say thriller spiller filler is what you want to do for your containers these would be great you're actually getting five you'll get five of them they're going to come to you like this and Rochelle is going to share exactly what you'll do with this when you get it home and why we love verbena so much so Rochelle tell us a little bit about these Oh, these are some of my, one of my favorite things. These are new this year, and uh, I'm so excited that we have them. They do come like this. We call these plugs. Mm -hmm. um, you get five of them. I've taken the liberty of actually planting three of them in a tiny pot just until I can get mine outside because I live way up north, and they're not quite ready to go into the ground yet. So when you it, it, when they arrive, you do want to get them into the ground um, as quickly as possible because they are little baby plants. But you shouldn't worry too much about the fact that they are little baby plants because they are uh, a native plant that is going to take to your garden very, very well. These are very easy to grow. They're hardy down to minus 10. I live up here in Boston. They should be fine right up to where I'm at. So if you're anywhere south of here, these are great. And what I love about them, I love the color. The color yeah. is just that perfect shade of hot pink. I, for me, sometimes hot pink can go wrong and this one does not. This is the good hot pink. So um, <laughs> I love this. I really, I have a, I have strong opinions about pink, but this is a good one. Um, <laughs> anyway, this is a great ground cover though. As you said, it's that thing you're gonna put right down in the front to keep the weeds away. Instead of having weeds, you will have have this instead covering the ground choking out everything else this is a native plant though which means that not only will it do really well in your garden because it grows natively in in uh, all up and down um, the country uh, but it also is going to support pollinators and insect life that you know needs to have those native plants made available to it for their food source and um, and being able to uh, to um, uh, Oh, I forget the word I'm trying to have babies basically like lay their eggs. <laughs> Reproduce. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Reproduce. I got Why you. It's early. It's <laughs> anyway, two, almost yeah. 2 a.m. on the East Coast here. I get it. But exactly. I, I think um, these are a good kind of um, 
no brainer too for people. Like I think if you're you're looking at your yard and you're like, oh, there's areas I don't know what to put there. I don't. I feel like you can fall back on this very easily because it's hardy and pretty Absolutely. easy to care for, and you get vibrant color and it can fill space. Would you say these would be good for hanging baskets as well, since they spill over? Yeah. Yeah, no, Wonderful. these are great for hanging basket. And I want to just say, you're getting five, which, yeah. uh, you know, two of these in a hanging basket will fill that right up. Um, you know, uh, one in a thriller, filler, spiller sort of situation should uh, fill out a container for you. So you really are getting quite a lot. And then if you have right. a, you know, bigger area that just needs a ground cover, you know, maybe bare, this is going to give you a nice area. Each of these is going to get about 18 inches all the way around. So you really have a lot of space that you're filling up here when you think about five of them yeah um they they, they really are a are, are real problem solver in the garden for people who just you know need honestly we shouldn't really like be thinking i always tell people mulch is not a feature um <laughs> you want to fill that space with plants yeah um and and actually by planting something like this you're going to be keeping the weeds out in a much better way that's mm. much better for the environment but also it's just so much prettier pretty. than it than filling yeah. an area with mulch do these so, would um, you say I, that I, these you know, grow pretty quickly like when, when we get them home like they this do. and we plant them they do. They do. Um, they're going to, yeah, they're going to fill out quite quickly. And again, these are perennials. Okay. So um, you, you can, they'll come back year in and year out um, so long as they're hardy uh, to your area. If okay. you're way up north, they are not hardy to you. But um, up here in Boston, they should be hardy all the way kind of across that zone six, minus 10. If it gets below minus 10, they would not be hardy. You'll have to treat them as an annual. But uh, for most of the country, you can you can count on that uh, coming back every year. I love it. Love it. You get five, by the way, so keep that in mind. Five. The HSN they're deal so is cool. incredible, right? $29.95 for that. So it's like $6 each. And they're going to be incredible ground cover, beautiful hot pink, the right hot pink, according to Rochelle. The right <laughs> they <one. are. laughs> they're so vibrant. And I love the foliage on these as well. I think the green and the hot pink is a perfect combo. And for all the other areas, maybe you've got, you know, chain link fence or a big AC unit or lots of garbage cans. If there's anywhere you want to add extra privacy or vibrancy, you might want to look at our today's special. It's a true 24 hour sale, brand new style of a tri and true favorite it's an expandable fence now with these blooms we have pink we have purple we have green and we have that really pretty ivory almost 3,000 gone already just from the first two presentations um, it's $39.95 and you can expand it vertically you can use it horizontally you can hose it down it's got a bamboo lattice design behind it and since it's faux it's easy care as well so a lot of people love to use these to hide things like I was mentioning Maybe you've got privacy issues, you know, out on a balcony or you want to hide trash cans. I use mine um, to hide underneath the stairs out by my pool. We've got all of our floaties and stuff behind there, too. So that's on our website at hsn.com. It's right on the home page if you want to take a look at it. Oh, my goodness, Rochelle. These are absolutely beautiful. We are gonna talk now about the Tupelo Honey Rose. $21.95, you are going to receive this. It's the bare root that you will be able to plant and get this incredible butterscotch yellow bloom on these roses. Rochelle, tell me about the Tupelo Honey Rose, wow. Oh, this is one of my favorite. I mean, anybody who doesn't love a yellow rose and all of the, the symbolism and this beautiful, the Tupelo honey yes. that goes with it is, you know, I just don't know. Uh, this is how it's going to come. It's going to come in this nice plastic bag and it'll be all sealed up. And mm -hmm. I want to just say, uh, keep it in that bag until you're ready to plant it because okay. that's keeping moisture in. Um, and what you're going to find once you take it out of the bag is like what you've got there. It's called a bare root rose. And the reason we do this is because this is actually the best way to transplant a rose. And the reason it's the best way is because you're getting actually uh, a rose that's two to three years old. It is quite substantial and we dig it out of the ground, we root prune it, we top prune it, and we ship it to you. And that is going to make it uh, be ready to go in the ground, put this down, you know, it's pretty easy, just kind of rebury it right up to where there's obviously like a dirt line right here. And you'll see a lot of them, um, I have a couple more here. Some of them even already have leaves budding out. You just need to get it into the ground. We're shipping pretty much across the country right now. And what you're going to get is one of the most beautiful yellow roses you have ever seen. This is a, um, 
very fragrant rose, or fa yeah, fairly fragrant stop rose. Smelling it. It's it it's so nice, um, mm. and it has a lot of petals. You're getting about sixty to seventy petals. These sometimes do um, what we call a uh, quadrant rose, where they start to swirl the petals uh -huh. into four little uh, corners because they're just so thick and full. Look how um, big that is! Just, it's the size of my hand. Stunning. Yeah, they are the best, best rose. Um, they're gonna grow, they're gonna uh, be incredibly disease resistant. Mm. Um, like the lavender that we had before, a lot of the roses that we're selling in these days, and when I say these days, I mean the last like four or five years, maybe a little bit more than that. Um, there has just been some tremendous breakthroughs in rose breeding. And so now all of these newer rose varieties have been bred to be both insect and disease resistant. You used to have to spray your roses like crazy and do all of this herbicide and pesticide application. And it was bleh, nobody wants to do that. And it was, you know, no good for anybody. And now you really don't have to do that anymore you don't need to be an advanced gardener you don't right. need to have an expertise to do roses anymore I used to think that I used to feel that I, I didn't grow roses for years even though I've been a gardener since I was like a kid because I was afraid of roses but now I don't have to be yeah because these new roses are so easy put it in the ground you're gonna get these gorgeous gorgeous roses this year, you'll get them this year. They'll continue to bloom again year after year. By the way, all of our perennials, all those perennials that we um, are, are selling, everything that we've had on the show tonight, they all come with our one-year guarantee. So anything that is, you know, doesn't, you know, do well for you this year, but even if it doesn't come back next year, mm -hmm. on our brochure, we have all the details of how to get in touch with us. If you have any questions, we have, um, our, we're a family-owned business out of Mobile, Alabama. There are people there to talk to you and answer yeah. all your questions. Um, so just give us a call if you have any issues with this or anything else, to be honest. Yeah, it's right there on the back. Yep. See all that? of the contact details, Facebook, Instagram, phone, email, all of it. So. Well, I just can't believe yeah. this turns into this. It is incredible. And Rochelle, it's always a joy to see you and work with you. Thank you so much for being on the show. And I hope you have a good night. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, Thank you. you. Too. Good night. See you soon.